Hello guys, in the previous videos we learned how to use Python scripts in LibreOffice Calc. Today we will find out how to embed the Python script inside a Calc file. This is very helpful when you want to transfer your custom Python function together with your data file. Let's get started. Here I'm in Calc. Suppose we have some Python script in the user Python script folder. Let's it open. In my PyScripts file, we have a Python macro that writes hello Python phrase in the cell B8. Let's run the script. How to create and run your own Python scripts in LibreOffice Calc, you can see in this video. But when we send the calc file to another user, he will not be able to run the Python macro because the Python code was saved in LibreOffice Calc itself, not in file, and left on your PC. To address the issue, we need to embed the Python code inside the LibreOffice Calc file with extension ODS. So, to do this, firstly close your calc file and make it copy. Rename the file, adding suffix embedded pi and change an extension to zip. Yes, an ODS file is just a zip archive of a bunch of files. Now unzip it into a separate folder using any activator for example, 7-zip or WinRAR. The archive can be deleted now. Then open the folder and create a new scripts folder. In the scripts folder, add another folder with name Python. And copy our script to the file Python folder. Let's slightly change the script. Open in meta in folder the manifest XML file. And add the following text string. Save and close. Now zip the all folders and files into one file. But pay attention, you need to zip internal stuff, but not the outer folder. Rename zip file into ODS. Open our modified file. Then in tools menu, open macros, organize macros, Python. 
expand our file name and you can see our Python macro. Let's run it. Everything works well. If the macro doesn't work, just check security settings, selecting tools, options, security, press macro security button and set the security level into medium or low. Now let's walk through how to add a Python based user defined function to a calc file. You will need to write the Python function itself, plus a supporting basic function to bridge it with calc. If you would like a visual guide, there is a video available that explains the process. So open a user Python script directory and add the Python function. Save the changes. Then add an intermediate basic function. We're gonna add it at a file level. Save the file. Now embed the Python scripts into DS file. and make some changes. Let's try out our function. As we can see, the embedded Python function works well. But pay attention, if you save the changes, the file will be rebuilt without Python stuff. So it means you need to add your Python code as the last step after saving your data in the calc file. So if the video was helpful for you, please like it and leave your comment. Thanks for watching and have a nice day. Bye!